Hi guys, Trotsky here. I know it's been a while since I post a previous video on YouTube, but uh, in the meantime I had some small health issue, but now everything is okay. But also my knife making academy in Wrocław in Poland is consuming me a lot of time. And today I want to show you how to make a grinding jig, the version 2, because the version 1 the video I posted, I don't know, 10 years ago. I improved a little bit this item, so come on guys, I will show you what you need. So the most important part is an L-profile square. It's made of aluminium because aluminium is light uh, and it's waterproof, so it, it will not rust. Uh, so this is the profile. The dimension is, is 10 centimeters here. 10 here and it's 8 mm thick so as you can see there are not so many items required uh, we got some screws some nuts and two golf balls why golf balls well because they are providing very good grip while grinding but also the other knife makers think that you are rich as fuck because you are playing golf this square is too big for our jig because it has 50 centimeters long uh, so we need to cut it in half first okay so we have two of them this one goes out this is our it will be our grinding jig. So now, this is the surface, uh, the grinding surface, and it's too wide, so we need to cut it here. So caliper is set up to four and a half. Now mark it. Okay, now we're gonna cut here. Using bell grinder, we need to uh, make all this dimension where we are cutting smooth. So, come on. The next step, we need to mark points for drilling the holes, and it's very important that these two has to be in the exactly same place on the other side so exact once again using the caliper I um, I set it for 12 millimeters I mark here 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 and here okay using puncher I'm marking the place where I'm gonna drill a hole over here and over here we can attach the screws and you can see they will give us an angle while grinding so now time for making the handle from the golf balls now time to drill a hole in a golf ball I use drill uh, 13 millimeter because the nuts have the same dimension, so it's up to you. To be sure that it lasts forever, we can add a little bit of epoxy over here. Mix it. Now I'm going to press the nut into the the bowl and wait a few minutes till the epoxy will stiffen. Now we need to drill two holes in our grinding surface to have them to mount the knife during the grinding so they should be at the same line.
we need to clean the entrance of the hole because everything should fit tight while grinding and this is it this is our grinding jig it's ready to use a few tips mounting a knife so we are using the bolt and the butterfly nut I recommend you to use clamp like this because the knife cannot move while grinding it will screw our plunge line we don't want that because the plunge line should be perfect in every knife you make another thing uh, here is the angle the grinding angle and we can increase it it is very easy just remove the ball and add some spacers I use one millimeter G10 spacers so for example if we add two of them of course the other side too we will increase the angle pretty much so basically this is it if you want to make a bevel line higher you just remove one or two spacers uh, and it will give you the higher bevel so now let's go to the grinder I will show you how the jig works So as you can see, it's working. Uh, it's not that hard to make a really good bevel using this jig because of the solid angle that is not changing during the grinding. So a little bit of practice and you will make grinds like this in a few minutes. Uh -huh. What else? Uh, this is my, my grinding jig. As you can see, uh, I did too many holes <laughs> and uh, it's useless. So now I know it because this is the version 1 and this is the version 2. So basically all my knives are the same shape, the same size I would say. So I have two holes, but if you are grinding different sizes of knives, I suggest you to, to drill a few more holes to keep the knife in the jig like this the tip is outside of the jig it's very comfortable while grinding you will discover it yourself I think everybody has a different style of grind grinding so so thanks for watching guys hope it was helpful for you and uh, see you next time <laughs>